Hey guys, so today we're gonna show you how to cut and light a cigar. So if you look up how to cut a cigar, there's gonna be various ways. Um, it's really up to you how you wanna do it. Today we're gonna show you how Jan Styles does it. Exactly. Um, so we have our Padron cigars right here. Um, basically, rule of thumb is you wanna cut on the shoulder, so basically where the rounded part of the cigar is. If you cut any lower, you're just kind of wasting tobacco at this point. Um, you would grab a cigar cutter like this one right here, or Blake has one as well that probably it, most, if you're not really gonna smoke cigars every day, this is probably what you're gonna have yeah. laying around. This is a little more high tech and intense. Both of them will get the job done. Exactly. But um, yeah, so basically the, the closer you cut to the top of the cigar, the less smoke is gonna get through on each draw, each puff. The more you cut off, the more smoke you're gonna get, the faster the cigar is gonna burn, the hotter the cigar is gonna burn. So it's all about personal preference and what you want. If you wanna smoke it a little longer, or you don't want it to be as hot or as harsh, it's better to leave a little more tobacco on the end, on the tip. Yeah. Um, also, if you're cutting a torpedo style cigar, um, actually, it's recommended that you just just cut the little tip off and you know I, obviously if you want more smoke you cut more off but it's better to start at the tip you can always cut more off later so basically we're gonna cut the cigar right now so you know you open it up you want to put it in you can kind of get a good grip on it so you can kind of touch it with the blade a little bit line it up and then when you cut it you just make one quick motion like yeah so guys make sure you're you're pretty confident when you're cutting it and make sure that it's nice and quick. So now that we cut the cigar, it's obvious that we gotta light the cigar. Exactly. And there's you know many different flames you can use. You can use a soft flame like a Bic or a Zippo, um, a match, um, or a torch lighter, which is what we're gonna use today. Um, the torch is recommended just because it's gonna give you a consistent flame. Like when you see like a Zippo or a, a match, it kind of burns like a candle, so it'll flicker hot, yeah. hotter and this is pretty much consistent. It's gonna, you know, be consistent. Nice and clean. Yes, so torch number one, match number two, Zippo or Bic would be number three in our opinion. Um, yeah, again, you could use any of them if you want. Yeah, uh, it, as long, it, you could go into a bonfire and light the cigar if that's all you had to light the cigar. But if you have this laying around, I would recommend this. When you light the flame, this is kind of the key. You wanna, you wanna get the torch, so right at, the, you don't even need to touch the flame to the cigar. Like the tip is where it's gonna be the hottest. You're gonna see it light up. And you just kinda of wanna roll it around slowly so you get a good mix going on. So you're just lighting the cigar, you don't have it nowhere near your mouth. Right, just... not, not yet. You're just you're just getting it kind of warmed up and prepped. Once once you get a good kind of red ring around there, then you wanna stick it in your mouth. And then you wanna get ready to start drawing the cigar. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So pretty much that's how you cut and light a cigar. It's really it's really personal, it's really up to you how you wanna do it, but this is how we, su we suggest to do it. Exactly, if you don't have a cutter, you can use a knife. Um, if you don't have a knife, you can just bite off the end. Honestly, a cutter is the best way, but whatever way you can open up the end of a cigar is gonna work if it's a last resort. Um, also, same with a lighter. Whatever flame you can use is gonna work for you, but we recommend a torch lighter. And once you have your cigar cut and lit, you don't have to constantly be smoking on it. You can literally take a puff every every minute, every two minutes. You don't have to constantly, it's not like a cigarette or anything. Yeah. Um, it's kind of just something to sit back and enjoy and relax while like you're- Appreciate it. Exactly. Yeah. And um, so our next video is actually gonna be how to smoke a cigar. So we're gonna go through kind of the steps, um, you know, like food pairings and drink pairings and you know, kind of what, what makes up a good cigar smoke, I guess. So thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe, like us on Instagram at Jens Lounge, hashtag your pictures, hashtag Jens Lounge, and uh, don't forget to follow us on Periscope at Jens underscore lounge, and make sure you guys enter the GL style challenge this week. Thanks guys. Thanks.